Hey guys, Happy New Year. I hope you guys had a wonderful and safe holiday. Um, I just got back from a trip um, back to my hometown as well as to Nashville and Knoxville, Tennessee. So yeah, I'll talk more about that on my vlog channel. Um, hopefully I'll get up, that up sometime this week. Um, but I told you guys in my last video that I was going to do a What's My Travel Makeup Bag. Um, and so I just got a new train case and this is pretty much like the stuff that I'm using the most right now. I'm um, a lot of those in my last haul and I'm really liking it right now. So I guess this, this could kind of be a favorites video as well. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and get started. This is my train case. I'm going to go to CVS. Um, and yeah, I'm really liking it so far. It was really good to travel with. It just opens up. I'm just going to start what I have start with what I have on the top pocket here before I forget um as well as a few like toiletries I brought um my nail polish um because the color that I was wearing wasn't what I wanted to wear for like New Year's and stuff um so brought my Sally Hansen Insta Dry Top Coat which I've used in the past um and I really liked it um uh, my Revlon Color Stay Nail Polish in Vintage Rose which is just a really pretty like mauvey neutral pink and OPI's Teenage Dream from the Katy Perry collection and this is the combo I'm wearing on my nails right now um I've had this on for like four or five days and um it just started chipping like maybe yesterday so um it's lasted a really long time so I attribute that to um the color stain nail polish and the top coat um I think that's been a really good combo um, moving on to the makeup, let's give you a quick overview of what's in here. I didn't fill it up too much, um, just because I actually didn't think I'd be staying as long as I did. I thought I'd only be there like a day or two, um, and ended up staying longer, which was great. Um, but for brushes, I just brought um, my Real Techniques Blush Brush, which was one of my favorites of 2012. Um, so if you guys want to know more about this, um, check out that video. I also brought my um, Sonia Kashuk blending brush, which um, got, I don't know, but it like got messed up somehow. I don't know. I mean, it still works, but not as well as it did before. Um, but I really like this. I've been using this for a long time as well. Um, I brought my e.l.f. eyelash curler, which I've been liking. Um, for face products, I brought my Maybelline Dream Up powder, which I recently hit pan on. Super exciting. I brought my Milani Baked Blush in the color Berry Amour, which I've been wearing pretty much every day since I got it um, the last week or so, week or two weeks. Um, it's just like a really pretty um, kind of rosy pink color, um, a bit on the warmer side, and it's got some gold shimmer in it guys can see so it gives you a really nice pretty glow I'm wearing it today as the brush falls out <laughs> um but yeah that's been one of my favorites lately um I also brought my wet and wild blush and mellow wine which also just gives you a really nice natural flush but this is a matte color so And then for, um, let's see, I guess I'll just go with eyes next. The mascaras I brought were my Maybelline Falsies and Black Drama, of course. And then my L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black. Um, also, for my primer, I brought my Maybelline Color Tattoo and Bat to the Bronze, which is also one of my favorites for December. Um, it's just a really great everyday color, um, especially for this time of the year. The formulation's really nice too. Um, I brought my L'Oreal Infallible Eyeshadow in Bronze to Taupe, which is, also has a really nice formula. Um, it's just like a, it's a bronze color, but it's a little bit more cool toned, um, because it does have like a taupey silver undertone. It's really, really pretty. And for eyeliner, I brought another one of my favorites from last year, um, the CoverGirl Liquid Lime Blast in black. 
Just an awesome liner. Definitely my favorite drugstore liner by far. And then for eyeshadows, I did really good. I only brought two, which I was really, really happy with. Um, proud of myself for that. I brought my CoverGirl Quad and Country Wood. Which I'm still kind of on the fence about. Um, some colors I'm liking more than others. Um, and the formula is kind of iffy on some of the colors, but I did wear um, this, like one of these colors for New Year's on my eyes because it's more of like a golden brown. Because um, I want to do like a gold eye with a red lip. And it worked out pretty well. I like the way it came out. Um, I also wore my Maybelline Duo in brown tones which is a staple, one of my all-time favorites. I'm wearing it today with another color on my eyes. Um, and then what I wore for my lips on New Year's was my Revlon Lip Gloss and Fire. This is from the Color Burst line. It's got the nice quilted packaging. And I actually um, Instagrammed a picture of this because I wore this um, in Tennessee too. And one of my friends complimented me on it, so that was really cool. Um, I brought my Revlon lipstick and mauve it over, of course. This is like an everyday staple for me. Um, I love it. And then I actually brought a lot of lip products I didn't realize. Um, I brought my e.l.f. Hyper Shine Gloss and Flirt just for a good like a neutral everyday pink. Gotta have that neutral color in there. Um, and I brought my NYC Liquid Lip Shine in Wine and Dine, which has also been one of my favorites from the last month. Um, it's just a gorgeous, deep, like, cranberry wine red color. It's super pretty on. Um, it's great pigmentation. It smells really good. Um, and it lasts a long time. And it's only, like, what, $3? So, pretty awesome. And then for my lip balm, I brought my, um, Coco Care Lip Balm in Cocoa Butter, which is awesome. Another one of my favorites from last year. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I am going to go ahead and go. I'm actually going to go and do a little bit of shopping today. So, let me know if you guys want to see a haul. I know I just did one, um, like, two recently. But um, let me know. Um, I also got some, like, non-beauty stuff that I'm going to be doing a haul for on my vlog channel. So, yeah, I think that's about it. Follow me on Instagram. Um... I'm loving that lately. I'm new to it, so it's been really fun. Um, and my other links will be down in the info bar as well. So, hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you later. Bye!